hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl cc and we are back at it again today with another video and in today's video we are going to be reacting to this has never happened in mecca before now over the last few weeks i have seen quite a lot of videos in relation to the change of environment in mecca and this is particularly referring to the lands and how they are changing so i'm not quite sure if this is what the video is going to be talking about but from the thumbnail i think that is what it's going to be talking about and i believe that this is one of the predictions in which prophet muhammad peace be upon him made so yeah let's get straight into today's video so we can learn more about it shall we now before we do get into today's video please do not forget to like comment share and please do not forget to subscribe and when you are subscribing make sure you turn on your post notifications so you get notified each time i do post and with that being said let's get straight into the video shall we brothers and sisters subscribe our new channel prevail islam your true guidance we are going to produce next level islamic quality content that will be informative fascinating and engaging links in the description box below Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters I hope you are well When you hear about Saudi Arabia what are the thoughts that come to your mind Masjid al Haram holy Kaaba and desert right but now the recent images of Saudi defies this and make it look like any european country Recent heavy rainfalls have changed the look of the desert to green and lush lands The country experienced heavy rainfall and flooding in western and central parts of the country in recent weeks leading to change in the land profile. In videos shared on social media, the mountainous region surrounding Mecca can be seen covered in greenery and plants, a far cry from its usual dry and arid nature. In the video, birds are heard chirping, a gentle breeze is flowing. camels are grazing and the look of mountains is just awe inspiring the cities of jeddah mecca and medina was also visible as green area in their satellite images the saudi residents expressed their joy and wish that this change in land profile becomes permanent there were posts on twitter and other social handles where people were seen rejoicing taking pictures having fun and even going for picnic changing deserts to lush green fertile lands was already predicted 1400 years ago by our prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam the last hour will not come before wealth becomes abundant and overflowing so much so that a man takes zakat out of his property and cannot find anyone to accept it from him until the land of arabia reverts to meadows and rivers subhanallah As per this prophecy the Arab land has changed to meadows and people are rejoicing over this sign of qiyama we muslims should get worried more and start working for our akhira because maybe the end of times has arrived when our prophet made this prediction none of the sahabi were able to comprehend it as per the look of infertile and barren deserts at that time but now we can witness this unimaginable allahu akbar Apart from the climate change resulting in heavy rainfalls, Saudi government has also started a green initiative under which 50 billion trees will be planted across 200 million hectares of infertile land. This initiative was started by the Crown Prince and has an estimated expenditure of about 2.5 billion dollars. 18 million trees are already planted up till now. We can see our prophet's prediction coming true in front of our eyes. We Muslims are advised to start working even harder and harder in this deen as these were some of the last signs of the final hour. The hour is not far away now brothers and sisters. This is a reminder to stop loving this dunya. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala strengthen our iman. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us among those who are constantly aware of qiyama. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make the Quran the light of our hearts. Amen. That's it for today brothers and sisters. I hope you liked the video. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you. Hey. Okay guys, that was honestly nice to see in terms of the change of environment. It's nice to see some green um happening, some grasses growing. It's nice to see in one of the videos, you know, you could see the breeze and you could hear the birds chirping and it sounds nice. However, I was literally going to say the exact same thing 
we need to be more fearful we need to be scared this is literally happening right in front of us a prediction that was made 1400 years ago by the prophet muhammad peace be upon him and it is happening in front of our eyes if this is not a sign for us to wake up and realize that the last hour is round the corner then i don't know but for me i genuinely feel like we need to be more fearful because that last hour is is scary it's not going to be nice and this is i can't believe it this is happening right in front of us however unfortunately a lot of people will still turn their eyes like at this stage i genuinely feel like there has been so many signs of the last hour now of course none of us nobody on this earth knows when that last hour is it could be in the next hundred years it could be in the next thousand years it could be even tomorrow nobody really and truly knows so we need to try our best to remember god in all things that we do you know for me i find this to be incredible the change is certainly incredible and for this to be happening in front of us as well like it's so mind-blowing like we need to actually wake up like for real even myself like i need to wake up yeah that is my thoughts on the video that is how i'm feeling i feel like this is a very 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 clear sign for us to wake up and i just pray that we do including myself like i need to even wake up myself honestly i really do i need to start taking dean seriously but yeah thank you all so much for joining me in today's video i hope this touched your soul i hope this touched your heart and i hope by god's grace that there will be change and that you know we will start taking god more seriously so yeah thank you all so much for joining me and i'll see you guys in the next video please do not forget to like comment share and please do not forget to subscribe and take good care of yourselves bye guys